ten years ago. That's when demons appeared in this world. Though they didn't come in large enough numbers to be widely recognized, they would only be noticed in occurrences and phenomena that were unable to be explained by any other means. So, for the average person, there isn't much impact on their day-to-day -day life. At least, not for the ones who don't believe in anything. <laughs> but it's a different story for the various religions that exist around the world. All their myths and stories have been proven to be false. Great disputes arose as those who believed in the monotheistic power of their own god clashed with those who equated such gods with evil. But the faith they all held was the only means of facing against wicked demons, and those in power at the time decided that they should manage the current situation. This was easier said than done, however. Demons present a constant problem, and not one that can be easily solved in a day or two. The discussions lasted years, involving large corporations, organizations, and the foundation of agencies. Even world governments had to intervene. Leading to the present day, all that hard work led to one particular result. The organization I belong to, a large organization known as the Church. Though it's called the Church, that's more of a generic name for the organization. It itself isn't a proper place of faith for the public to come and worship in though a few come to say prayers. Aside from a few forces, the faiths of the world have united for the sole purpose of protecting humanity from the threat possessed by demon kind. A foundation called HQ leads the case management of incidents involving demons, and the branch offices that complete those cases receive evaluations and remuneration. This HQ is an organization with a large number of branch offices attached to it. Collectively, it's known as the Church. And right now, I'm working at one such branch office as a priest. So basically, Demons appeared 10 years ago, but they only appeared to people who had strong faith, but it didn't matter what religion they had faith in, as long as they had faith in a religion, they could see the demons, and the demons apparently didn't match up with any religion <laughs> that existed. Oh, I'm sure that was quite a surprise to some people. But you know, it actually has an element of truth to it. There are many benefits to being religious, but none of those benefits seem to be tied to whatever particular religion you're a part of. It seems like having faith alone is enough sometimes. <laughs> of course, having access to supplies from a large organi organized uh, Organization doesn't hurt either. But anyway, let's move on. Ah, uh, Akiyama san, Richard sama, welcome back. Thanks, Kana san. Anything happened while we were out? Hiroyuki sama from the vault stopped by. He has something to talk about regarding that issue around the sacred tools. He was waiting here until just a moment ago, and then he received an urgent communication from the vault and left in a hurry. Hmm. 
Never a dull moment for that guy. Sounds like we'll need to go see him ourselves then. Richard, I'll head straight out to the vault. You have a short rest for now. Uh, understood. Be careful. Richard Sama, that girl was looking for you. It sounded like you went off on a mission without saying anything to her again. I explained the job to her, but it would probably be best to inform her of your return yourself. Uh, thanks for doing that for me. I appreciate it. It's fine. <laughs> now then, please go see her. I'm sure that girl's been eagerly waiting to see you again. Alright. Yep, can't interact with anyone. Just go to the event. Proceed, yes. <laughs> So this is where you were. Hi, Nina. I wonder if she should actually be calling him Daddy here. Anyway, whatever. Father! Welcome back! Thanks, Nina. Have you been good while I was away? Don't give me that! You left for a job without saying anything again! The minute you finally come back home after so long, you go and leave me all alone again? I can't believe you! S sorry Nina. I was suddenly called out by akiyama -san. Which by the way, yes, this is the same Nina as in Shrift 1. For those who don't know. Sorry to drop that bombshell on you, but yes. This is her before she became a demon. But I'm really surprised. You used to be such a crybaby. But now you've grown in both stature and personality. What's that supposed to mean? Jeez, father. Do you make plans with me to go out to town today? Come on, let's go! Nina, hold on! <laughs> father. That's what she calls me, despite the fact that we aren't related by blood. I had come to this place with her eight years ago, before this town was under the jurisdiction of the Forming Church. They say I collapsed nearby with her in my arms. She's calling me Father for as long as I can remember, and both uh, I and everyone around us just go along with it. But the truth is, I have no memory of her at all. Despite not really knowing anything about me or Nina, Okaya-san and Akiyama-san at the time accepted us without saying a word about it. Feeling a deep sense of gratitude to those two, I decided to get baptized and become a priest, spending the next eight years trying to become a father at HQ. Leading to now, where I was officially dispatched here by HQ under the pretext of protecting the city from the threat of demons. I don't have any interest in knowing what happened to me back then, but I'm sure something significant did happen. It was enough to make me flee to a church with a baby in my arms. I have the sense that I must keep her away from any and all misfortune and unhappy. <laughs> yep. 
But today will be that day our everyday lives together would crumple apart. Will it all end happily or unhappily? Of that, I have no idea right now. This is the story of you searching for your happy ending. Uh, and I cannot keep this song. <laughs> Light side, you're going to have to offer up something. I've seen what the dark has to offer. Cushion <laughs> good. Yeah, that's Nina. We can talk to the. Oh, we can't. It's been about eight years since the founding of the church. I heard that when they were setting it up, the organization was being modeled off an atheist society like Japan. I guess they had to do that with all the religious disputes and wars that go on around the world. Humans really are hopeless like that. I wasn't sure how this consolidation of the churches would turn out. I'm really glad to still have a place to go pray. <clears throat> oh, Richard Sama. I suppose you're free right now. Thing is, I have personal requests that come in from the people in town unrelated to church orders. Would you mind going out to do them? Personal request, you say? Normally, requests from the town folk would go through the church HQ. Although, along with any compensation for us holy workers that complete the job. But if it's really urgent, then there are occasions when town's folk will come here directly to put in their request. And that's what happened this time as well. The place in question is the public cemetery. Akiyama-sama isn't back yet, so it'd be a huge help if you can go there instead. Uh, got it! I'll gladly do it if it means I can help you to- I mean, help the townsfolk! I mean, if the, I want to help you too, I don't give a fuck- I don't give a shit about the townsfolk. <laughs> Oh my, how reassuring. And I'll rely on you to see it done. The person who made the request is at the scene. Please talk to them for the details. This will be your first real job as a holy man, won't it? Please do your best out there. Alright. Alright, to the cemetery.
I know that, but anywhere. What a pain. I thought coming here alone wouldn't be a problem, but someone might get suspicious if they see me. If I can't get ordinary, I can't get ordinary people wrapped up in this. I sure hope that church person shows up soon. Uh, um, are you the one who put in that request for the church? Hi, Hyaki. It's been a while. I miss you. <laughs> Oh, you sure kept me waiting! Are you the guy who's handling this demon-related job for me? I yes I suppose I am. Though, I'm a newbie who's only just arrived in town. What a kawinky dink I've only just got here, too. I work as one of them old-fashioned roaming peddlers. I'm called Yaki. You just remember the name. Oh, I'll never forget it. <laughs> um, I'm Richard. I look forward to working with you. So, could you tell me what this request is about? Just through here is an underground crypt pathway. It seems lately that wandering spirits have been increasing with in numbers there. They aren't much of a threat. But there are a lot of them in there, apparently. Enough that ordinary humans would have a hard time dealing with them. What? Wandering spirits? Are they a kind of demon? Huh? You don't know about them? I guess you weren't kidding about being a newbie. They're demonic fragments that can't materialize into a proper cell. It might be easier to understand if you think of them like evil spirits. They're weaker than demons. They had to scour their magic in order to destroy them. So basically, you have to use the same tactics as you deal with actual demons. The same tactics? You mean holy purification? That's the one! That's why I made a request for one of you from the church to handle it. I don't need you to purge all of them in there. Just enough to make it safe for me to go through. I'll consider the job done if you can make it to the first script further in. That's where I'll give you your payment, too. Doesn't sound too shabby, does it? Uh, I see. So, basically you want me to secure a safe passage through the crypt, right? Makes sense. Not that she needs any protection. <laughs> Thanks a ton. I gave you a bunch of items that might come in handy. If you get lost or things start getting hairy, don't hesitate to use them. No sense in wasting your life and all that. I'll head out after I've made some preparations, so you go on ahead. I'll catch up soon enough. Alright. Do your current earn to finish quest here. Oh, suppress Gakis. Collect 10 Gaki souls. Let five of the strange fruit that drop from mandates. That's not until later. Ah, uh, because I've done all of this before. That's uh, that's what it is. Okay, so I can't get the quest again, but I can get the gaki. Ten gaki souls. Alright, so coming after making. 